<laughs> hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video for today and this time I'm taking a look at the Red Band trailer for Nobody, which is a, uh, oh I'm sorry, excuse me, the exclusive, exclusive Red Band trailer for Nobody. Uh, if this is up on anywhere besides IGN, uh, make sure you flag it because that's, if someone re-uploaded this trailer and, and it's not a reaction, that's not that's not allowed no no this is the exclusive red band trailer you know what i want i want to make sure hold on red band trailer if it's not if it's a red band trailer i won't be upset Ooh, oh nerdist shame i don't think you uh oh this is a reaction okay oh oh no oh you know you know you messed up hey stop i didn't i didn't say play anyway this is a movie directed by the guy that did Hardcore Henry, which I loved. And, of course, Bob Odenkirk's in it, as you can see. Christopher Lloyd's in it, who I also love. So, immediately, I was like... I was actually looking forward to this movie for a little bit once I heard that the director um, of Hardcore Henry was doing it. Um, I love Hardcore Henry. So good. Anyway, um, yeah, this is Nobody. Let's, let's find out who, who who's Nobody. This guy, obviously. Uh, that was Blind Wave. Shout-outs to Blind Wave. They're great. Anyway, let's go. Let's uh, let's find out. He's gonna he gonna get punched in the face. Watch. See? <laughs> he took that shit. Oh yeah. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. I love that red. That shade of red is amazing. So they took maybe twenty bucks on an old watch. Mr. Madsen, did you even take a swing? No. Could have taken her, Dad. Heard you had some excitement yeah, what the last hell? night. I wish they'd have picked my place, you know? Oh. Nice. Why didn't you take him out? I was just trying to keep the damage to a minimum. Yeah, how's that working out for you? Oh, this you looks... Okay. You don't look okay. There's a long dormant piece of me. Not so very badly wants out. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Jesse what and Wall about to get their ass beat. Old man. I'm gonna fuck you up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah! Oh, I'm so in. You're, you sold me. Oh, and it's produced by him. Years, I worked for some very dangerous people. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm in. This looks amazing. Right? The what is happening? Don't call nine one one. Don't call nine one one. I'm about to have me some fun. They call an auditor. I'm gonna have me some fun. Anyone wants to see at their door? I you never. You didn't have long to live. Oh. This looks awesome. I get behind to start a family. I might have uh, overcorrected. <laughs> what do you have you bodies crashed. in there? You've abandoned a certain debt that needs repayment. And your creditor is aware of your resurrection. Okay, so he was. Right. Thinking after my family died. Uh, they stole my kitty cat bracelet. What? Don't fucking do that. <laughs> oh my god. Give me the goddamn kitty cat bracelet. Oh my god. He looks like shit. Dad, you should see the other guys. <laughs> They're dead. Oh! Oh! No, nah, it was a good shot. Who the fuck are you? Me? Nobody. That was a good. That was a good trailer. I never would have thought Bob Odenkirk. In theaters only. Yeah, we'll see about that. Um, I would love to see that in a theater. I would love to see any of these movies in theaters when it's safe to go. Um, that was a really good trailer. Um, I I expected it to be kind of like a cross of John Wick with uh 
with something else. I was thinking maybe when he said the cat bracelet, I was thinking maybe Keanu, but I, I don't think that's going to be a big... That's not his whole driving force. I'm thinking, like, what's a movie about like, someone that's, like, pent up and wants to, like, just beat the shit out of people? I feel like... I, I, I feel like I should know a movie like that. I'm sure there is a movie. I'm just not thinking of it right now. Like a mix of John Wick and uh, like the last Rambo movie. Because it looks like there's a lot of... Well, no. In John Wick, there's a scene where people try to kill him in his own house. And that looks like it's only one time it happens. Um, but, uh, yeah. Hey, I, I never would have thought Bob Odenkirk could be a, an action star. But you know what? I'm sold. Dude, that shot of him. Can I get that shot where he's, uh, he's on the wall with the... He's against the wall right here somewhere. I think it's right. It's right after this. <laughs> it was really good. Right here. Here, fuck you. That's good shit. But I left it behind to start a family. Yeah. All right, so it's very John Wick. It's like if John Wick grew older, and he looked like Bob Odenkirk <laughs> with his with his wife. He had a couple kids, and then he had to come back. Because it meant you didn't have long to live. I almost wish. I almost wish he didn't have a backstory like that. I, I, I almost wish he was just somebody that was fed up. Kind of like like a falling down. There you go. Um, with uh, Michael Douglas. Uh, who, who's not really a badass in that movie. Uh, yeah, I, I, I guess he has his moments. He's a normal dude that just had, had enough and goes postal. Um, not that I'm saying he's like the hero of that movie. He's not, but whatever. Uh, he's definitely not. Um... Oh, who's who else is in that movie? Oh shit, who is it? Is it Robert Duvall? I think it's Robert Duvall. Um, he's the hero. Whoever the cop is going after, he's obviously the hero. I'm falling, I'm falling down guy is a, I forgot the actual character's name, but uh, he's the he's the guy that you you like to see him do things, but you want him stopped because he's he's fucking things up. Um, he does he does stop that racist guy though. Right? He goes in that racist shot. Yeah, I'm not going to spoil Falling Down. Watch Falling Down. It's a really good movie. Rest in peace, Joel Schumacher. Um, but yeah, this looks really good. Um, I'm upset I didn't say from the director of Hardcore Henry. I guess it did say his name at the end. But, um, now, I didn't see. Did it say David Leach is producing? Oh, it's written. No, it's written by somebody else. Yeah. yeah. Ilya... I I don't know no Schuler I don't know how to pronounce his name. That's why I didn't before. <laughs> I was just like uh, Ilya. I remember watching interviews with this guy and, and behind the scenes stuff like back when Harker Henry came out four years ago. But I don't remember how to pronounce his name now. Um, I'm glad he's directing movies still. That's awesome. I still, I'm still holding out hope one day he will direct a Doom movie. I think he can, he, of anybody out there can do it. He, hey, he did so well with Harker Henry. Just make a movie first person about a Doom guy. Um, and you don't even need to make it a huge budget. Just make it in like a dark, like, plate. I don't know. Kind of like what the uh, original Doom movie ch did where everything was dark and stuff and demons would pop up out of nowhere. You don't need to make it like the newer ones and have it like huge budget, giant environments, you know? I'm sure nobody wants to give money to that because it's not a proven thing, I guess. I mean, I guess Netflix could do it. I'm sure people will watch it if it's on Netflix, even if it doesn't have like a big star. Just cast Dwayne The Rock Johnson in it. Whatever. He'll be Doom Guy. You'll never see his face, but you'll see his fucking giant biceps. Um, maybe you'll look in a mirror once, and you can see, like, you can see his eyes through the, <laughs> through the mask. I guess you can kind of see his face, too. There you go. Then you can say, and then you use that for the poster. Be like, Dwayne Johnson is the Doom Slayer. Or, if it's the original Doom, you'll still be Doom Guy. Doom Guy. Doom Marine. Space Marine. Whatever you want to call him. Um, anyway. That's never gonna happen. Uh, well, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, that will definitely never happen, but... I don't think we'll ever get a Doom movie that is entirely first-person perspective. Yeah. It doesn't even need to be first-person perspective the entire time. It would be cool, like, if just for, like, all, all the action scenes or something, it just goes, like, the camera just, like, tr strategically goes behind the Doom Slayer and, like, actually somehow, like, maybe not even behind him, it, like, swoops in and, like, goes in front of him and then the rest of the, and you see his arms raise up and he's just like, he's just like, let's go or whatever. I don't know. Anyway. There you go. That's it. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. This movie looks great. I'm actually very excited for it. Um...
<laughs> Christopher Lloyd's like, I'm sure barely in the movie. Uh, it seemed like that. He's barely in the trailer, but whatever. I'm here. I'm here for Bob Odenkirk murdering people like John Wick. So I'm in. I'm in. Give him the kitty cat bracelet. Whatever.